Day 601. Welcome to the pool. It's like 3, say if I say 3.27 p.m. I just got here. Uh, I got up at like noon, did a bunch of stuff around the house, got the WLP to 1, which I'll do later. And uh, I thought, you know what? Why not come up and book a couple hours? There's chances of thunderstorms because it's so freaking hot and humid. It's in the low 90s right now. But uh, why not come and kick back for a bit, right? So it's just me today, but all of the accoutrements are here for everybody else who I don't really know what they're doing today, but they're not here. And uh, I am broiling. I am just on fire. So I'm going to have to go in the pool and cool off. All right, it is 440. Uh, so beautiful, really hot. I just went in for a little bit. Um, water's great, 81 degrees. Love this pool. It's, it's a little dated, but <laughs> it's an awesome pool. It's 15 feet over there in the middle, 12 there, 10 along here, and then it ramps up. And it's like five and a half all the way down to two and a half feet down there. But the dark clouds went north, and they're kind of out that way now. And our weather seems to be coming from over here, so a couple white ones. Doesn't look too bad. I'm going to head over to my grandparents' house now and uh, help him clean out his fountain. He's got a couple odds and ends over there, so good hour or two here and uh, we'll go work a little bit and hopefully get some dinner because I'm hungry. Well there we are, 100 degrees at 4.46 p.m. Holy crap. Beautiful day though. These clouds are still dissipating. We got good music on here. Last time I was listening to this where we, i listened to it since probably, but in California on the 15, headed to San Diego. Um, now I'm headed to Silver Lake, whatever. Oh, I'm just leaving. I left my camera in the car the whole time right there in front of the shifter So I wasn't able to film anything. Anyways, it is 803 Still beautiful 88 degrees right now. I would love to go to the pool, but I think they just closed All right, But go back to the pool anyways We had dinner and steak and puke again, and I don't know why everybody hates it. I always have such a good healthy meal there um, I am obviously kidding about the healthy part of it, but it's always very good. Oh no! No! Somebody is getting dickered. Good news is it is not I. It is somebody in a little talent, or I don't know what that was. Yes, Emma, I know. Okay, we're getting gas, and we have, you guys want to introduce yourself? Two giant fans, I'm Sam Shaw. I'm okay. Cool, you guys live in Hudson? Yes. yes, we do. Awesome. Anyways, it's, I don't know, we six, 601. Yeah, we're out cruising tonight, and I've never seen you guys before, and I'm always out, so. Oh, that's okay. Maybe it's new. Happy Saturday night. Looks like $65 got me almost 16 gallons of gas. Yes, I would love a receipt, which will come out here. And that was really awesome. Just met those two guys. Um, just out, there's a band down here tonight. It's a Beatles tribute band. I'm cruising around, and I saw them waving at me, so I went around the block. And they followed me over here to the gas station, so that is very cool. Sam and Mitchell, I want to say. I'm sorry if that's wrong, and I'm sorry that was awkward. I, I usually don't meet people that actually know who I am and understand what this thing I'm doing right now is called, because I'm getting a lot of looks. Mostly from that guy over there with the Honda shirt driving a, it looks like an Oldsmobile. I can't really tell. We'll watch him, we'll, we'll film the shit out of him here in a minute. Yep, it looks like a, a Grand Prix maybe, or some Oldsmobile, I don't know. But it's kind of weird he's wearing a Honda shirt. Alright, gotta be at Kenan's house soon, so I'm gonna do a quick walk around, see if there's any car spots. Oh, that would have been a perfect place to park, little did I know. I said car spots, I meant cars. Let's see if any Tim, anybody's out tonight. We've got a Velasta, Veloster, an A6, a Toyota, an Odyssey. I'll let you know. GL. Alright, Tim, it doesn't work as well as the BMW C3. See, si, tenemos un Porsche 944 Turbo, a couple years old. And the Buick Rendezvous, or Enclave, whatever the f*** it is. Hi, Kenan's on his way down, so that is good news. We have kind of had clouds roll in. Um, I think I did mention some Beatles tribute band, they're pretty decent, so I'll come over and continue the hunt for notable automobiles. Check out the uh, old Accord slash Civic parking there. Not so great. Fap. 4139. This is where that 430 was a few days ago. Now I think I see an E-Class cab over there. And a Volvo. And uh, a Dodge. Looking a little dodgy there with some uh, some colorful driving today. And uh, the light's red, so we take a right. Nice setup, bro. Check it out. Oh, very well done. Those must be from Stoke. Very, very well done. Nice. It's, it's, it's a little thicker. 
Hallelujah. It's raining. Check it out. For the first time and I don't even know how long now, it's been a while, we are finally getting some precip. It's about 1.35 in the morning right now and it's very nice outside. It's actually, as I say, as it's raining, but temperature wise, it's probably 80 degrees and uh, still very humid. Lots of thunder, a little bit of lightning. See if I can catch any of that on camera. I'm filming out in my front yard. Yeah, it's just coming from the west, so I'll film over there. But, um, pool today. Dinner, fixed the fountain at the grandparents' house. Forgot the camera a couple times. Uh, went over to Kenan's house, laid out on the deck for a while. Back home now, time to go jump on YouTubes and get stuff did. And I left my pool stuff in the trunk. I make this mistake every day. I get home from the pool and immediately have something to do, so I forget it and leave all of the stuff back here, which means the next day when I want to go to the pool, my bathing suit is soaking wet, which sucks. The concert downtown was pretty cool. I, I, don't, I filmed a little bit of that. Uh, Beatles tribute band, surprisingly decent. Uh, met a bunch of people, which is awesome. Um, anybody in town here that watches the videos here in Hudson, uh, you see my car, you see me, don't hesitate to say hi. I know it was a little awkward today because that, that's really the first time I've met people in person. Uh, that's not true. I met somebody in Coldstone once. Um, and then my dad knew somebody in Michigan, I think, that knew me. But um, anyways, cool. And at the Bow store, I met somebody there that watched the videos and knew who I was from my reviews on the old tech channel. But if you see me and you see my car, leave me a note. Surprise me. Please don't you do anything with your keys. But you know what I mean. It's, it's always nice to... Uh, to meet somebody that knows and understands and knows what a vlog is because most people see me doing this around in public and just look like, what is he doing? And it's, it's weird. Another mistake I constantly make. When I'm downtown for an extended period of time, I like to buy one of these. And we filmed these before. The label is missing now, but it's one of those strawberry melon brisk drinks. And uh, when I get in the car to come home, I always throw it, uh, since my cup holders, one aren't big enough and two they suck. I throw it uh, on the passenger seat with the cap on tightly or on, in the footwell in the passenger area. And then I get home and I get out of the car and I go inside and I put a vlog together and I watch YouTube videos and I go to bed. And then the next day I come out and I see something rattling around that is my drink, which is by that point very, very, very warm, like this is. Before I walk around in the rain too long, I'm going to end this here. Day 601 is success. Thanks for watching. Tomorrow 602, Sunday. It's supposed to rain quite a bit, which is fine. That will make the yards grow, which in turn makes me green cash. Um, so, uh, so tomorrow will be a catch-up day, which I need. And then Monday through Wednesday next week is supposed to be very sunny, very warm. And I am hoping that they will be productive pool, lawn mowing days, and uh, enjoying these three and a half-ish weeks of summer we have before I have to do a little bit of work. But, uh, but that's okay. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow in 602. Good night.